What's going on guys? It's Corbin here from AcousticWorld.net and I'm going to jump into it. Uh, I just have a quick uh, but very important message for you guys and the message is that you should not hang your guitar up on the wall. Um, and this may sound, you know, either very boring or like a huge oversimplification and like a stupid thing to be concerned about. Um, Cause I know a lot of people really love displaying their guitars. You know, if you own an expensive instrument or a really cool looking guitar, it's, uh, it's totally understandable that you would want to display it and kind of show it off uh, to people. And it also sort of inspires you to play, just uh, being able to see it, you're more likely to pick it up and play. And so I totally get uh, those reasons for wanting to have your guitar, you know, sitting out. Um, but for me, the, the risks outweigh those things. And I'm going to get into those risks right now to, uh, help you protect your instrument. And, uh, yeah. So the first problem is that, uh, even if you set up your guitar wall hanger, uh, correctly, uh, it can still get ripped off of, uh, it can literally get ripped out of the wall. Uh, even if you drill it into the, the wall posts and support beams and do everything you're supposed to do, um, depending on how heavy the guitar is that you're hanging. Um, and I, I'm telling you this from firsthand experience. So I had a, a Les Paul, um, just a white Epiphone Les Paul uh, hanging in my bedroom uh, back in my house in Pennsylvania. And it literally ripped out of the wall. It ripped the wall hanger out of the uh, the support beams and fell onto the floor. Um, luckily, the guitar wasn't damaged or broken, um, but it happened at like three in the morning too. <laughs> so it woke me up, and uh, and yeah, it was just uh, kind of a mess. And I would never have expected it to happen because uh, again, you know, you set up the hanger correctly and do all of that and still, you know, this kind of thing is still uh, liable to happen. Um, you know, people might argue, oh, that's because a Les Paul is literally <laughs> the, probably the heaviest guitar you could possibly hang up. So, um, and the, you know, fair enough, if you have a light guitar, obviously it's less of a concern, but still uh, after that experience, I'm never gonna be hanging a, a guitar up again. Um, the other thing is like, if you have people over, it's tempting for them to just like take it down and, and or like bump into it on accident. Um, so the, the guitar can get knocked over that way too. Um, the other thing is I find uh, just leaving guitars out in general, either even if they're not hanging and they're just in a stand or something, uh, I find my strings don't last as long. Um, the fretboard wood needs more attention paid to it in terms of like it seems to dry out quicker. Um, the guitars are more sensitive to the humidity level uh, if they're not in their case too. So that's less important for electrics, but if you have an acoustic guitar, um, especially again, like an expensive one, um, if you leave it out in, you know, hanging or in a stand and uh, you live in a really dry climate, it can actually crack the face of the guitar. Um, if you don't believe me, just join uh, <laughs> any Martin or Taylor guitar owners group on Facebook and people are constantly posting their cracked guitar faces in there because they just leave them, their guitars sitting out uh, in an open room with no uh, humidity set up. And yeah, just like a multiple thousand dollar guitar, just like uh, getting a huge gash in the, uh, in the top of the wood uh, because you know, basically an acoustic guitar, the wood paneling uh, is kind of thin. And uh, even though there is a finish, um, the wood still expands or contracts depending on the humidity levels. So that, um, that movement can ultimately result in a crack of the guitar, which is obviously not ideal. So you know, for all of those reasons, I I will never hang a guitar up. Uh, I know it's not a popular thing to say, um, but that's kind of, that's my stance. And, you know, so I'll show you guys. Um, oh, I can't flip this around. Give me a second here. 
Yeah, I'll show you guys my um, my guitar setup. I literally just you know keep them in in the case over here. Um, and again, I know that's not super sexy, uh, <laughs> um, but that's you know that's what I do, and it works for me. So I don't know. I, I hope that helped out. I know it's not the most exciting idea for a video, but you know could potentially save you thousands of dollars. So <laughs> I'll see you in the next video, guys. Uh, peace.